Hello and welcome back to Eternal Hope. Um, we have another short message and a song that we'll be singing after the message. And it is called Victory in Jesus. There's a verse in scripture in Psalm 98.1 that says, O oh, sing unto the Lord a new song, for he hath done marvelous things. His right hand and his holy arm hath gotten him the victory. So we can see that victory comes not through deceit and corruption, but through the Lord's right hand and his holy arm. From 1 Corinthians 15, 54, 55, and 57 say, So when this corruptible shall have put on incorruption, and this mortal shall have put on immortality, then shall be brought to pass the saying that is written, Death is swallowed up in victory. O death, where is thy sting? O grave, where is thy victory? Now, we can see that from the beginning of the world that nations have been vying for the kingdom of this world, uh, trying to conquest one another uh, by their own might and power, but it's only a very short-lived victory. And we know that we don't have any power over death, over the grave, but we know someone who does. And verse 57 says, But thanks be to God, which give us the victory through our Lord Jesus Christ. So in him is true and lasting victory. In 1 John 5, 4, it says, For whatsoever is born of God overcometh the world. And this is the victory that overcometh the world, even our faith. So our faith in Christ is tantamount to having victory in him. In Isaiah 25, 8, he says, He will swallow up death in victory, and the Lord God will wipe away tears from off all faces, and the rebuke of his people shall he take away from off all the earth, for the Lord has spoken it. So the Lord himself has spoken this, not some man, not mere mortal man who's going to die and go into the grave, but the Lord God himself. So those, those are promises that we can just hang on to and count on forever. So until next time, God bless. Oh